We're less than a week into hurricane season, which means you still have time to get ready. And forecasters are calling for a slightly above average season. Janelle Buda spoke with one of those researchers on why they're making that prediction. The recent rain and flooding is a very real reminder of what any hurricane season may bring to Texas's Gulf Coast, especially this year with a prediction of 18 named storms. Um, of those 18, eight becoming hurricanes and of those eight, four becoming major category three, four, five hurricanes. Research scientist Phil Klotzbach with Colorado State University is part of the team there that makes that prediction, updating that forecast on Thursday. We basically look a lot at precursor signals. So basically what sets of climate conditions preceded active hurricane seasons in the past and alternatively which set preceded inactive seasons in the past. They do this by looking at the climate conditions that led into hurricane seasons in the past, and they match up the climate conditions we've experienced this year to those other seasons. So I'm looking for years in the past that had conditions most similar to what we currently see and what we expect to see for the peak of the season. And he says this year's conditions most closely match those of these six years, 1996, 2001, 2006, 2008, 2011, and 2017. Our final forecast is close to the average of those six analog years. As a Houstonian, it's hard not to fall out of your seat when you hear those years. 2001 brought Tropical Storm Allison, 2008 brought Hurricane Ike, and 2017 brought Harvey. But he says just because the conditions align doesn't mean the same storms will come. Just because, for example, 2008 is an analog year doesn't necessarily mean we're expecting another Hurricane Ike in 2021. Certainly, we hope that's not the case. Remember, those other three years, the Houston area wasn't hit as hard, but that doesn't mean we're safe. It just means there's potential and you should be ready. Whereas early in the season, Texas can be um, impacted by significant hurricanes, even as early as June. Um, so now is really the time to have a plan in place and know what you're going to do if these storms do threaten. In Houston, Janelle Blue to KHOU 11 News. Again, now is the time to be prepared for any storm. A good hurricane kit will include enough water and non-perishable food to last three to seven days. Sports drinks are also a good idea for staying hydrated. You should have a non-electric can opener and disposable plates and utensils as well. You'll find much more information in our Hurricane Preparedness Guide. To get it, just go to khou.com slash hurricane or text the word weather to 713-526-1111.